Hello, welcome to Dubai. We're at the Madnat Jumeirah Hotel and Entertainment Complex on the shores of the Arabian Gulf for the 2007 Archery World Cup Final. The uh, 16 best archers in the world are here, the top four in four categories. We've had the semi-finals, we are now into the finals and the bronze medal matches. And here we are, the bronze medal match in the uh, women's recurve uh, compound, rather, and it's uh, Jamie Van Natter who will start us underway. 12 arrows only, three arrows in each end. And a good start from the American with 10 on her first arrow. Kazan Saver, the uh, Russian, who uh, lost out to Petra Eriksson. Both of these ladies losing out in a tie break, so it was very, very tight indeed. Only 20 seconds for each of these women to let go of that arrow. The clock you can see there, midway to the target. A tie at the moment. 19 points each after two arrows. Here's a woman who's very consistent over the last two years. Four rounds leading up to this World Cup final. She was first in Dover in England, Jamie Van Natter, second in Varese. And Anna Kazantseva from Russia. She was first in Olsan and Antalya in Turkey. You may be surprised in that case to uh, see that they're in the bronze medal playoff, but uh, that's the way it's panned out. Under fairly hot conditions here, it has to be said. So 29 points for the Russian, 28 points for the American. And it'll be the American, Van Natter, to get us underway in the, the second set of three arrows. Only takes 10 seconds and a nice score of 10 there. 12 centimetres, just over 12 centimetres across that uh, middle 10 target, and that's a bad miss. A bad miss from the Russian. You expect uh, better consistency. So Van Natta now finds herself one point to the good. A nine. She's never beaten this woman, Jimmy Van Natta. Perhaps this might be a good time to start. Prize money at stake here as well. $20,000 for the winner. We'll see the uh, gold medal matches later on. That's a good 10 from the American. Third will be $5,000, fourth 1000 So there is a, a financial as well as a uh, pride incentive here. Well, there you go. 57 plays 53 as uh, they regroup at the halfway mark. Quite a big lead, really. The uh, compound bow, we will see two types of bow today. The compound bow you can see there, which has a system of pulleys and levers. Uh, also, uh, better sights than the more traditional recurve uh, bows. So it should lead to more consistency. And the fact it's got uh, pulleys on there means that even if it's a, a 60 pound bow, you're not pulling back 60 pounds. You can adjust the pulleys so it's perhaps even less than half that weight you're pulling back, which again helps you with your accuracy. But you do need some composure to make sure you're hitting the tens as often as possible. So four points behind at the halfway point and another eight. Well, this is uh, disappointing from Kazantseva, the uh, Russian, to say the least. Yes. She said she was very consistent, and she is very consistent. She's five points to the good with seven arrows shot. That's more like it. Two stage wins, the Russian. She's no slouch, but she is 
well behind at the moment. And Van Natta just needs to keep her nerve and keep her accuracy in. That's the way to do it. A 10. Still five points the difference. A 9 and a 10 for Van Natta. An 8 and a 10 and a 9 for Cousin Seva. The last arrow of the three for Van Natta. And that just goes to the left for nine points. But it's still a five-point lead for Jamie Van Natta in the sunshine of Dubai. It's pretty hot here at the moment. It's uh, winter in Dubai, but uh, you never know it if you're from colder climes. I know the, uh, Van Natta said she'd come from snow uh, in uh, the US. She's uh, 29 years old, a systems al analyst engineering degree for her. She started archery way back in 1990. Her opponent, uh, much newer to the game, only started in 99. Even though she is older, she is uh, 35. And it's his Kazatseva who will take the uh, first arrow. And that's a nine. See the uh, timing clock on your screen, only 20 seconds. Very often in uh, archery events you'll get uh, 30 seconds, but not here. That's a poor shot from the Russian, and she looks to the skies. Really giving Van Natter a chance to turn the screw here. Ten. Oh, it's a lovely shot. One more arrow to go for the Russian. She's on 97. Nine. That's a nine. Van Natter really needs three or more. It should be easy for the bronze for Van Natter, the American. And a 10. What a way to wrap it up. It's $5,000 for Van Natter. It's uh, a good result for the American. And uh, really, for Anna Kazantseva, never came to the races. Really, a couple of really poor shots. Eights is not what you expect to see. And a big hug from her coach. Well, Jamie Van Natter, first place in the rankings for the World Cup in 2007. She would have wanted to go all the way, that's for sure. Um, she d hasn't, but third place, certainly better than the fourth, that's for sure. Chance to uh, wave at the crowd. And head off presentations will be later on. But she's done very well to recover that. All smiles from her and her coach.